Imagine this, you're the successful owner of an e-commerce store when suddenly your site starts redirecting to a scam page. People can enter to win a free $1,000 Walmart gift card. All they have to do is enter their social security number. Unfortunately for you, you forgot to set up automatic backups, leaving you left to clean up the mess and figure out how to reset your website. If this sounds unlikely, it's not. This happens to many WordPress websites, and it's one of the many reasons why you need backups. So what is a backup? It's an independent copy of your WordPress site with files in the database so you can upload it to any web hosting account, just as if it was live on your domain. Okay, so now that we know what a backup is, why bother with the hassle of WordPress backups? Well, first of all, it protects you when making edits to your site. Listen, I've been using WordPress for years, and sometimes when you go to edit pages or add new plugins, things don't go well and your site just explodes. It starts giving you error messages or something doesn't load right. And if you have a backup from before you started editing the page or the site, you can just roll back to that backup and try again using a different method. The second reason you need backups for WordPress is in the event that your site gets compromised. Now I know what you're thinking. My site's not gonna get compromised, but, but hold on a second. Sometimes that happens with WordPress sites. And if that ever were to occur to your site, having a backup means that you can restore your site to before the incident occurred. Then you can do some investigating, figure out why the site was hacked and put measures in place to protect it with minimal downtime. If you don't have a backup and your site gets compromised, well, have fun piecing it back together manually. And if you think a site compromise is an edge case scenario, that's not the case with WordPress. Your WordPress site is a target. And no, it's not because the hackers are interested in your bakery or blog or landscaping business. Trust me, your business is not that interesting to hackers, but your WordPress site is. See, hackers are looking to exploit WordPress sites using common vulnerabilities so they can use your web hosting for malicious things, such as redirecting it to a scam page. Once I had a client whose site got compromised and their website started redirecting to one of those Windows tech support scam pages. They called me in a panic, and rightfully so, and I was left to investigate how their site got compromised, why it was redirecting to the scam page, and how I was going to fix it. And the worst part was, I had no backup. Yes, that's right. I had to piece the site back together one by one, reverse engineering what changes the hacker made to get that redirect in place. I had to manually fix it, all because I didn't have a backup. And that's when, in that moment, I said I'm never having a website without automatic daily backups again. I implemented it for the client site, and I implemented it for all of my websites going forward. This part of the video is for those of you who have been procrastinating backing up your WordPress site because you haven't been burned yet. Trust me, you don't wanna wait till it's too late. There are so many great solutions to back up your WordPress website website that you'll hear about in this video. So please, back up your WordPress site, okay? Okay, awesome. So it's evident that WordPress backups are important for every website, but there's one important qualifier that you need when setting up backups for your website. They need to be automated. There are many solutions to back up WordPress, but this is not that helpful when you have to remember to do it regularly. One of the simplest ways to back up WordPress would be to use a free plugin to download a local copy. But again, you have to remember when to do this, and if you forget, you're not gonna be in a good situation. The great news is there are tons of WordPress plugins that can back up your site automatically. This is the ideal solution because you don't have to remember to back up your site. It's done in automatic intervals, and if you ever have an incident, you can just pull the backup from the server and restore it. Plugins like Updraft Plus, Backup Buddy, Blog Vault, and Jetpack all provide these solutions. There's one problem with these plugins though. Automatic backups all require the paid versions, and they're all really expensive. Updraft Plus is $70 a year, Backup Buddy starts at $99 a year, and Blog Vault starts at $89 a year. These solutions may sound like a good deal, but they're actually not providing a backup storage solution. While they do offer automatic backups, you have to provide a place for them to send those files. 
You could use Google Drive or Dropbox or an Amazon S3 bucket, but you have to pay the provider for storage on top of paying for the paid plugin. For the price of the plugin, they really should be providing server storage, but they're not, and that means it's really not a good deal. There's a backup solution that I believe is affordable and makes sense for the majority of websites. But before I tell you about that, I want to tell you about MailJet, the sponsor of today's video. Hey, business owner, have you ever wanted to create an email list and send beautiful looking emails to your customers? I have too, but who wants to deal with the headache of trying to create a nice looking email? I know that I don't have the time or patience to deal with coding, and that's where MailJet can help. MailJet is an easy to use email marketing platform for designing, sending, and monitoring campaigns. MailJet's editor makes it super easy to create engaging email campaigns, newsletters, and automated emails in minutes. There's no coding, everything is drag and drop, and you can take advantage of beautiful pre-designed templates to save you time. MailJet has some amazing features like automated email workflows, so you can engage your customers at just the right time without having to remember to send the emails. MailJet also gives you a ton of statistics. You can track email performance in real time and get access actionable insights on how to create more engaging campaigns. MailJet is the best way to connect with your customers, whether you're a solo entrepreneur or a team. Thanks to MailJet for sponsoring today's video. Head on over to mailjet.com slash made to try it for free. Now that we've reviewed a few backup options for WordPress, I wanna take a look at my preferred option that I'd recommend to most people. This isn't the easiest option to set up because it's actually reliant on your web host. I think the best automatic backup solution for WordPress is simply to use a web host that includes free automatic backups. Listen, you could go the plugin route, but plugins are expensive. Although you do get the control to put your backup files wherever you want, but if you go the web host route, you don't have to pay for backup storage, you have controls integrated to restore backups easily in your web hosting panel, and it really is set it and forget it. You're not gonna be using up extra resources in your WordPress site for that plugin to try and copy all the files. Your web host just does it in the background. It's kind of magic. A few years ago, web hosts that offered quality automatic backups were typically just premium, high-end, managed WordPress hosts. But a lot has changed over the past few years. Quality web hosting is becoming more affordable, and now I think it makes sense to just get good web hosting instead of paying for a plugin. Hosts like Flywheel, WP Engine, and Cloudways all offer amazing automatic backups and amazing features that I think are worth the price. Let me give you an example. Let's say you had some cheap shared web hosting from a site like Namecheap. We'll use their Stellar plan, which is $4.48 a month. It doesn't include automatic backup, so you're gonna need a paid plugin. Let's use Backup Buddy, that's $99 a year. So if we average out the cost of web hosting and backups, you're paying around $12.73 a month for hosting and backups. Instead, what if we just paid for nicer web hosting? Let's look at Flywheel. We could pay $15 a month for their tiny plan, it includes automatic daily backups, and it includes a whole bunch of premium features that you're not going to get at Namecheap. I think this solution is going to make sense for the majority of websites, but what if you have a low traffic website and you're trying to keep costs down as much as possible? If you absolutely need a free backup solution, I would use the free version of Updraft Plus. It's actually decent. It allows you to backup your site to destinations like Dropbox, Google Drive, or an Amazon S3 bucket for free. The big catch is, if you want it to be automated, you do have to pay for the premium version. And as I pointed out earlier, I think upgrading to a paid backup plugin just doesn't make sense when you could put the money into better web hosting, which will also include free automatic backups. So if you absolutely need a free backup solution, use the free version of Updraft Plus. And if you've already prepaid for years of web hosting or you're unable to migrate for some reason, you could consider upgrading to the paid version of Updraft Plus or Backup Buddy. But if you're able to migrate your website, I would highly recommend checking out Flywheel. 
Their tiny plan for $15 a month provides automatic backups, a staging environment, and the web hosting is going to be much higher quality than hosts like Namecheap or GoDaddy or Hostinger. And if you have a lot of websites you need to host, check out Cloudways. You actually get an entire server instance for one price at Cloudways. So it's the most affordable way to host a bunch of websites and you still get automatic daily backups, staging environments, and all of the premium features. And if your website sees a lot of traffic, don't neglect to capture customer emails so you can build your email list. I like to use exit intent pop-ups to ensure visitors have an opportunity to enter their email before they leave the site. I like Mailjet to build engaging email campaigns to send to my audience. You can try Mailjet for free at mailjet.com slash made. And if you're looking for a step-by-step -step guide on how to build a WordPress website, I actually have an entire free course that you can watch right here.